All right, everybody, welcome back to the first day of actual hunting out here. Uh, I found another bullet. Got some rings on it, pretty cool. Old bullet's been up here for a while, down about two inches. Des picked it up, so. All right, we'll see you at the next one. Hey everyone, welcome back. I just got another good target. It looks like there's some kind of lead projectile, maybe a pellet. Looks awful lot like a pellet. Check out the base there. Look at that. Look at the pedals. I've never seen a pellet like this before. So pretty cool. Alright, I'll take it. That was down uh, two, three inches. So, anyways, I'll catch you at the next one. Thanks for watching. Thank you for all your support. Uh, I saw before I came up here that I finally hit 300 subscribers. So, thank you guys, all of you, for all your support. I appreciate it. Alright. All right, everybody, welcome back. Uh, just got another good sounding target here, solid 69. Uh, I'm over here by where Mr. Clinton here from Lost Ways Tre Treasure and Metal Detecting is camped. And check this out, bottle top or tank top or lantern top. I don't know what that is. If you guys know what that is, please let me know. If I find out, I will write it on here. All right, that's pretty cool. See you at the next. Alright everybody, welcome back. I just got my first score nail of the trip. Probably many more to come, so nice and straight one this time. Alright, see you at the next good target. Alright everybody, we're over here with Clinton again. Lost Ways Metal Detecting, and he, check this out, he got a bullet inside a chunk of wood. We just pried it out, that's pretty cool. This little 22 bullet. Nice job. Thank you, that's cool. That was neat. Alright, we'll see you at the next one. Hey everybody, welcome back. I just got a, another good target here. It's a lid with the logo CM on it. I don't know what that is, but we'll have to look it up. Alright, see you at the next one. Hey, hey, ladies and gents, welcome back. I got my first real iron relic today. It's about 1 o'clock in the afternoon, 1.30. And check that out. It's like an old pick. There's the flat spot. And there's the pointed end. Pretty awesome. I'm glad to have that, man. That is a cool relic. All right. I'll see you at the next one. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Tough Run Metal Detecting. I just got that pick up the mountain away. It's a little up there. I just got a nice, nice high tone. It was deep. It was barely a blip. But uh, I tested it and tested it, and I decided to dig it and check this out. Some kind of O clip. I don't know what that went to, but it sure is pretty. All right, I'll take it. Nice brass, piece of brass. All right, see you at the next good target. Hey there, buddy. I just got another seven, eight, nine inch deep, tiny blip underneath this giant pile, pile of pine needles and down a ways in the dirt. And check it out. There was a target there. The cool thing about this is you can't read it, but it says U.S. right there. I've never found a small cartridge that says U.S. like that. Pretty cool. All right, we'll see you at the next one. Awesome. Hey, all you tough runners, welcome back. Uh, I just got another good uh, signal here. Check it out. It's a tiny, tiny clip to something. Spender clip or something. Yeah, it was down maybe two inches right there. And this is the path that pretty much everyone keeps walking by so it's got to go low and slow I guess all right I'll catch it the next good target I just found on me little turd I'm gonna kill you welcome back to tough run metal detecting um, I'm out on day two got a little bit of a later start than everyone else but I'm up on the hillside here you can see there's a road down there Working my way up this hill in areas, and I got this weird target. It's a 70, 72, 76 target. I don't know what this is. No markings. Some kind of cylinder of some sort. Sorry, it's out of focus there. Yeah, very interesting. All right, I'll take it. Add it, and we'll carry on. See you at the next. Back 
like the tougher and metal detecting. Uh, we're up here, there's an old bottle lamp down there, so people are digging some bottles. And uh, I got a couple of bottles myself. It's pretty cool, this one right here. It says Pharmacy, Boise, Idaho. It's broken, it's too bad, but it's still pretty cool. And then, I got a nice bottom to a bottle here, down there. I'm up here detecting. Uh, everybody else is down there in the main part of the dump, but yeah, it's pretty cool. So, uh, somebody actually found a Washington State tax token down there while they're bottle digging, so that's a neat find as well, being out of state here in Idaho, so. All right, well, thanks for watching. Uh, keep on going. I'll catch you at the next good target. All right, see you soon. Hey, everybody. Welcome back. I just got this weird signal right here. I think it's iron. I think it was grunting iron, but high bouncing, and it's very, very sharp at the end. not sure what it would have been for. I don't think that's a nail, so maybe a tine to a fork, possibly. I don't know. All right, see you at the next. Hey, everybody, welcome back. It's a little warm out here today. Um, I just stopped for a quick snack break, and now I just got a nice nickel bouncing signal here. Check this out. This is the first for me, a complete tobacco tin that is not crushed, and that's pretty awesome. Base is nice, a little bit of a dent, but not, not very bad at all. So it'll clean up real good. All right. Thanks for watching. We'll catch you at the next good target. All right, everybody. Welcome back to Tough Run Metal Detecting. I forgot to do this when I was out in the field, but uh, this target that I dug, the Prince Albert tin, um, actually had a solid dirt plug in it. And when I dumped it out, check that out. That is a 100-year-old tobacco. It was preserved because there was a solid plug underneath it, so that's pretty freaking awesome. Uh, I didn't expect that, so I'm ecstatic with this. Uh, I'm going to end up giving it to my brother, but uh, anyways, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, I'll add some clips and close-ups and other stuff at the end here with some music. Hopefully you guys enjoy and see the kind of experience that I had out here at Spud Diggers event. So, all right, thanks for watching. I appreciate all your support. Take care. Happy hunting. Bye-bye.